Hi guys, I'm back with another video. Today's video is going to be a fan film review of Nightmare on Elm, a Freddy Krueger horror fan film. I would like to thank you guys so much for watching my short film on Thursday. Um, like I said again, I'm sorry for that video coming out on Thursday instead of Tuesday. But thank you so much for watching that video. Um, I'm surprised about how many views it got. I don't know if, it's, if it was what I said at the beginning or if it was just the video in general. But thank you guys for watching that video so I can do a fan film today. And now my schedule is back to normal. So, uh, this was made uh, one year ago. It has 4.1k thousand likes, or views I mean. 123 likes, 0 dislikes, 32 comments. And Christopher Shed... Field has 2.59k thousand subscribers. The basic synopsis comes from the description of the video. Jimmy hasn't slept, or Johnny hasn't slept. Johnny can't sleep because Kruger is waiting for him. So, what do I like about it? Well, it's horror related. Um... It's Nightmare on Elm Street slash Freddy Cougar related. Um, now, the story itself is very okay. Um, it's like every Nightmare on Elm Street ever. Um, Freddy Cougar is targeting somebody and they're having dreams about Freddy Cougar. And then Freddy Cougar kills them. That's exactly what this... That's exactly what this fan film is. But there's a couple things I actually like about it. The production value is very good for the fan film. For this fan film, the production value is actually very good. It's very high. So I think the people that made this fan film put a lot of work into it and had a lot of money to make this fan film happen. Because the high production value was pretty good in this fan film. And I really liked it. And overall, the fan film looked really good. The look of Freddy Krueger looked good. Um, it, you know, it didn't exactly look like Freddy Krueger, Robert England, But they did a good job with it and it looked very well. I was very happy that Freddy Krueger actually really looked good. The kill was awesome and looked very good. The best part of the fan film. Yes, the kill scene was the best part of the fan film. Um, now, there wasn't many kills. It was just one. But it was the person Freddy Krueger was following throughout the fan film. The kill itself looked awesome. So, Freddy Krueger pretended... To be the girlfriend or friend. I'm not too sure. I think they might be boyfriend and girlfriend. But I'm not too sure. Um, he started. Uh, he started. He actually looked like the girlfriend. And Freddy Krueger comes out of his. Comes out of her mouth. And uses his claw to rip his tongue out. I thought it was a really cool scene. A really cool kill. I'm not happy with how many kills are in the fan film, but that's my... I always have a nitpick like that, so... But the the fan film itself was very good. The production value is good. The look of Freddy Krueger was good, and the kill looked very awesome and really good. So, what do I give this fan film out of 10? I give this fan film a 7.5 out of 10. And that's my fan film review of Nightmare on Elm, a Freddy Krueger horror film. And if you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace, period. P.S. Thank you guys again for watching my short film on short film review of short film audiobook Attack of the Tattoo Goosebumps. Peace, guys.